What is good friends, you guys could vote on Twitter and most of you wanted three shot on lives a week, which is a lot. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to do that, but yeah, I felt like recording a live. This is a team my man insult used in ulti. I still haven't uploaded the game where he used this in, but you guys can expect that um, probably in the next days. But basically it's a team that sorry mates with um, Rocky Helmet Tornadoes, Focus Blast for Heatran and I think it also came in it would have came in clutch in his old T game if he hit a Focus Blast was his Mawa but he missed one. Uh, we got Rox, Dianzi, yeah just B Bandit Glare, Zygarde, Scarf Rachi, which is um, really cool with Healing Wish to bring back a threat like one of these three and then we got Avery Tangros with HP Fire and Sludge Bomb. Uh, Sludge Bomb so we make sure we don't lose to the um, don't lose to Tapu Bulu and stuff like that. So turn one, I can either U-turn or knock off here. Oh, I don't have knock off. I'm so used to having knock off on my. <laughs> I'm so used to having knock off on my. I could actually fire off a hurricane. Um, just in case he stays in to go for rocks. I'm expecting him to go Pex though. Yeah, I'm expecting him to go Pex, which is why I'm going to U-turn. This guy is inviting his gang. Uh, he doesn't have to know that I'm a YouTuber. I'm using... <laughs> okay, he just toxic. So he's Scarf Toxic Lando. Good to know. We get information right there. Um, this gives us DNC and we get free rocks. Um, yeah, Scarf Toxic is used on Landris. It hits Tornadoes and then it hits um, Tapu Bulu and Tangrowth. And it also helps with um, Halucha a little bit, as this, this guy is a bit weak to Halucha if his Pex is not Fizz Death, so it makes sense. Now, this is annoying, this Pex, because I don't want my Kieran to get burned and my Zygarde, so like, dude, what the fuck? I don't like how this team can't switch into Pex. Yeah, but this is just a free U-turn again, as he defogs. Um, yeah, we can just get them back up here, honestly. Uh, maybe it would have been better to just go Zygarde. I think it would have been better to go Zygarde and claim my kill. That was definitely a misplay on my part, so my bad about that, guys. I could have just gone ban Zygarde there and claimed my kill as he was locked in. Well, not claimed my kill, but gotten a huge amount of damage on something. He was, like, locked in. Well, I just I just came here and then I U-turn next turn. I'm not sure what I'm going to U-turn out into because I have no switch into this. Um, maybe I will have to... Maybe I should hard U-turn and let my Tangros get poisoned by one layer instead of two layers. Though I don't think that's going to make a huge difference because I don't want to stay in with my Tangros that long in this game anyway. Huh. Maybe I should have U-turned the Yancy on a T-Spike and then... But like he would have gotten a T-Spike up in the long run anyway. I don't think I could have prevented that. So <laughs> he's just going to skull here. Um... The... I don't have rest on this, otherwise I would have hard Zygarde. I mean, I guess I can go hard Zygarde because I don't want to sit here for 5 years and let this game never end. And at least I can't get burned because of the T-Spike. But yeah, I will link you guys um, the poll I made on Twitter where you can vote how many li lives you want to see in a week. I'll link you that, it's still going on for like 2 or 3 days I think. At the moment, 3 lives is winning, then there's an option to vote on 2 lives a week, 1 life a week or 1 life every 2 weeks. Um, yeah, realistically, like realistic is one or two lives a week, but most of you guys wanted three, so I will try my best. Just go vote there, please, because um, I want like as many opinions as I can get. And yeah, that's good damage on Cartana. Now I will find out if he's bandit. Um, my taunt should be able to live any one hit, even if he's bandit. Well, looking at his team, he's either bandit or Z-move, yeah. Actually, he could be Z-move, so maybe... Maybe this is not so smart to go hard torn because if he co crashes, I think I lose my torn. So there you go, Tang. I think I go Tang. Because the Tang has HP fire. Um, he knocks. Okay. I regret going to this now. <laughs> I thought he would potentially co co crash and I thought I could pivot from Tang into torn. Oh well. Um, yeah, I think I'm. That was like a misplay on my end. Because what if he goes for Z-move now and bobs my torn anyway? I mean, not a, my AV wasn't doing much in this game, I guess. Uh, he might have quick here predicting me to go Rachi. Oh, he just switches. Cool, cool, cool. I can go Curum and Fusion Bolt. I think that's a heat play. I think that's a... Oh, wait, I forgot about the T-Spot. <laughs> 
I th I swear I didn't see the T spike. My mon was in the way. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna f fusion bolt break in the packs, and now we get a kill with um, Sub Zero Slammer, which is um, well. Do I have to do that? Yeah, I think I want to do that. Just Sub Zero Slammer on the Pharaoh here and kill it. I mean, it's gonna like do a lot to the Pharaoh. I just don't want to ice beam into the Pharaoh. Oh, he sacks the land. Oh, I should have ice beamed then. Hmm. Like ice beam was an option right there, but if if I ice beam into the Pharaoh zone, then he can pivot back into Pax on a Z, which is like another 50-50. And with T spikes on my side, I get worn down, so that's not in my favor. He could also have protect on Pharaoh, so like, well, maybe I should have ice beam there. I definitely didn't play this game optimally, uh, however you say that. Nice bad English coming in clutch. It's like late at night right here. Uh, that doesn't have to do anything with my English. My English is like always... Like some sometimes I just mess up my English. It's not my first language. I'm um, pretty sure most of you guys know anyway. Like from the way I talk you can probably tell that English is not my first language. But um, you can go Kartana here. Or Ladi or Blaze. Um, probably doesn't want to go Blaze to take rocks though. But yeah, he just lost his Defogger, which is good for me in the sense that rocks are here to stay to chip the Blaze. And. I mean, if the Blaze is Scarf, I feel like it's a threat. Definitely. Definitely a huge threat. I have to be careful because. Damn, Scarf Blaze might just do it versus me. Thankfully, my DNC is at full, so I should be able to live a hit. Though, if he. Um, if he ever gets a boost. Did I disconnect? I did not, right? This guy's just taking his time. He goes on the cure room. I would just wanted to import my team here. Yeah, I should have done that like while I was pausing it. I wanna run a cult from Blaze versus um Blaze actually. Okay, that's Bandit, I think. And I wanna predict the feral zone here. You want to see a huge, a hard play, double into Jirachi and fire punch the Pharothorn? No one is gonna scout for that. <laughs> Let me call it that. Um, if he's deaf, if that kills is what I want to know, Pharothorn. Which he might be a bit more fist deaf on this team since he also has a pex. Um, yeah, that actually does 59 to 70. That does nothing. Hello? What is that damage? Uh, yeah, anyway, Jirachi is the play because it covers. Pharaoh and it covers him staying in like if he stayed in for some reason now well he could knock off my scarf which I cannot afford to let it get knocked <laughs> well if I'm him I'm if I'm him I would not knock off here what would I do damn this is bad I should not have done this why did I go to this because if I, I don't think he's gonna knock off so I'm gonna fire punch but if he knocks here I'm screwed okay he rocks now he's either attacking or going packs or Ladi is an option as well. Mm. I feel like I can go to my Tangrowth here, which blocks the leech sheet if he stays in. And yeah, it just <clears throat> kind of covers the packs. But this game is gonna be like dirty. <laughs> the T spikes, dude. Definitely could have played around them different. Like early on the game, I should have gone hard Zygarde and like not gotten a kill, but gotten huge damage on something. But instead, I just got rocks back up, so that was like a misplay on my end. I'll just go Rachi here. Um, this is bad. Comment Megalati. So he switches, predicting what? I'm not sure what he predicted there. So what I could do here, if, he, if I go to this, he's just gonna rock again. So I would have to hit a Kano or a Focus Blast. Mm -mm -mm. Damn, because if I go cure him, he might go Pax. Oh man, I'm just gonna go cure him anyway. Wait, does this even kill with ice beam? <laughs> I feel like this doesn't even kill him. Also, I don't like shiny Kyurem, but I just kept the colors um, from the original team. But yeah, pacement for the team is gonna be in the description if you guys wanna test it out. Um, I got another squad right after. Wait, why am I loading this? Uh, I meant to load this team. Cause Z-Fly Land was like my favorite set. I guess I'll use that one later on a different live. Wait, this guy's taking so much time. Like, hello? What are you thinking about? You just call. I mean, I guess he might be calking. But yeah, this is. I, did, I don't know if I talked about it yet, but this account name is disgusting. My man Seal made this account. 
and I didn't really have any accounts with points so this one is at least around the 1600 so I just snatched it account up um, yeah I snatched that account and I'm I think he's asleep right now but he doesn't he probably doesn't mind if I get some points for him now I have to run a calc damn I think I lose to the clown well the clown is probably spec so the NC can always revenge it yeah, yeah there's no way it's either Z or it's it's Z or specs. It's probably Z, yeah. Cause there's no way you have double scarf on this build. So I think I just U turn build. Dude, this is bad. <laughs> Cause if I U turn, he can just recover here, knowing that he lives it. Maybe I should iron head. Oh yeah, early he switched out fearing the iron head. That's why he switched, obviously. But um. TT bolted. Hello. I was able to get a little bit of regen, and I guess I'll just go for the flinch now. That does nothing. Should I go for the flinch or should I double out? I feel like I should double out here. Um, Pex of Pharaoh coming out. Pex of Pharaoh coming out. I think I go DNC here. And. Well, this is bad because you can just go Pex here. Damn, the Yancy didn't even cover the packs, but yeah, I guess I break with the Pharaoh. Mm -mm -mm. Like, why is he taking so long? Cool. Obviously, if he scarf blaze, I'm pretty sure I just lose to Shadow Ball or Fire Move if my DNC gets chipped a bit more, maybe. Because mm -mm -mm. I lost the AV on my tank, did I? I think so. Yeah, so. Is he scarf? There's no way you scarf, my guy. What? No, you, you have to be bluffing me. Yeah, you're not Scarf. Yeah, get the fuck out. You're not bluffing me, dude. What? Why didn't you go to Pex? You have a Pex right there. But yeah, thankfully, yeah, well, I, he was he went hard into it, thankfully, there. Because that one kind of got a kill every time. Like, I just had to keep DNC alive, basically, so I can revenge it. I definitely didn't play this game optimally, whatever. Ah, nice bad English plus misplace coming in handy dandy. But yeah, this guy's just timer stalling me, so... Yeah, Pex walls me. I think this is max special attack. Wait. Oh yeah, I was gonna say this is max special attack off power, but that's the second DNC team I have. Never mind, that's a different one. Oh no, no, Intel changed the team, right? Right. Sorry, was using made a different version and Intel changed it. Um. I mean, yeah, that does absolutely nothing, as you guys can see. So I will keep this and switch out because I can potentially win the tie versus the Ladi. Um, I'll switch out into my torn to Devog, I think. Do I do that? No, I think I go so good this. Why can I not talk? I, that sounded so weird. And I just knock. Yeah, I just knock. Because after rocks, the Ladi um, is super low. If it, somehow, if it somehow lives the knock, which I don't think it does. If it somehow lives it, it's forced to recover, which gives me free turns, so it's fine. But yeah, for the most part, I'm using fun teams in this li in these lives. I made like some. Whenever I try to build, it's like either a team that already has been made, or it's like a super fat team that like wins every game, but the games take too long, so there's no point in using it in the video. Like I did that once in my road to top ten. I used like one of my fatter builds. <clears throat> like you have to be super patient, and the videos like not only I have to be patient because the games are long. You guys also have to be patient. <laughs> Wait, I don't know if that's the play torn. Uh, I have a Zygarde, which is the play actually. <laughs> like that, and that's in that regard, the T spikes actually helped me out because I could not get burned switching this in. But like, why did the first game take 15 minutes? Like, that's not my fault. Like, I know sometimes I play super slow and I make the games go longer, but this time it was mainly my opponent taking his sweet time. Yeah, I just attack here. This. Um, no reason to let him like heal for free. He's gonna have to attack me and basically what I'm gonna do is uh, I'll just go to Yancy and try to win the speed tie. And if I don't win the speed tie then I wait, my Yancy had doesn't know <laughs> My Yancy is messed up EVs, IVs, whatever. No Does this dude think it's auras? You can make it 31. <laughs> Okay, that's my own fault for not double checking before the game, but that it's one it was not even a speed tie. Um, 
yeah you turn stronger so gg to that good dude even though i forgot to say gg uh, let me iron next this okay we got another one versus scary looking team megina is uh, boss especially with z moves but yeah let me hit you with a half fun oh yeah i kind of like ignored that last guy that was not on purpose i don't know why i didn't respond but well i didn't respond at the first time i don't like them <laughs> To know when I'm recording. Eh. It's fine. People like try it as shit when you tell them you're recording. But basically, I think I just U turn here and hopefully I lose the speed tie to get a slow U turn. Thankfully, I lose the speed tie there and now uh, I can go my Kyurem here. I can go Kyurem. Well, he has a scissor. And I can't even double because he can just U turn. Yeah, I can go DNC and get my rocks. Yeah, that, that's, that's a good play. I get DNC. Go to Yancy, get rocks. Stay in regular form to keep that bulk. Take less from the U-turn. Um, I don't know why the sprites aren't working. He really went hard scissor. I was thinking about going for HP fire. But he has a Megina, which I thought was AV. And I thought he would also go Clef or Megina. But yeah, I could have HP fire there. I'm not sure why he went hard scissor. Now, the scissor is actually a huge problem. Obviously, we have 5 punch on Rachi and HP fire on Tang, but... God, this is all the threat. <laughs> like, how do I switch into this? Can somebody explain to me? I mean, looking at his team, this should be... Is it... I cannot tell what item, but I think it's not default, because Torn should be the default. I don't know what to switch into, if I'm being honest, right here. Because <laughs> I don't want to stay in and die to Bullet Punch. Uh, I guess I go Rachi. But I also don't want to, like, go something that gives him setup. If he knocks here, I'm screwed, but he just Bullet Punches here. I figured he would Bullet Punch, because... Um... I'm a DNC and HP fire is a thing that does absolutely nothing, has the chance to burn that we don't get, okay. And now I have to just be careful that I don't go to something that lets the scissor heal. I cannot let the scissor heal for free. Um, I could go DNC. If I go DNC, uh, I feel like he's just gonna U-turn into his Megina. I'm definitely gonna HP fire here because... Well, he's not going scissor. He is. Yeah, I don't get ladder players. <laughs> maybe, maybe his Megina is not AV, but it has to be AV because look how weak he's to Ash Ninja. So Kalio is most likely Scarf the way he brings it out. He doesn't really have a great double to punish me, so he's trying to burn me. I see how it is. Dog, big dog. No. Um, I want to double into my Kyurem here, anticipating him to go into Tornadus. And I'm lagging. Well, not me, but like... I can just fire off my Z-Move here, I feel. I kind of feel like fusion bolting here. <laughs> yeah, I feel like just fusion bolting. Um, I think he's either gonna go Megiana or Keldeo. Maybe Clef as well. If he goes Garchomp here, this guy is a Dawn Farther. <laughs> if he's like, I wanna set Garchomp and he goes to it, then I look like a chunk. Uh, I keep my Z move, which is cool because they can bop the Clef after chip. And now I can. Also, yeah, I have the dimensions a bit different than the other time. I think this time the dimensions are worse. I should have made it so you guys can see all the sprites from the boys down here. Um, I was like playing a random battle to like change the dimensions. Um, I'll just go tank here. Wait, this tank does not have earthquake, but it has HP fire. Does it have earthquake? Oh, I also should have checked Tangros. Dude, Tangros also doesn't have 31. I swear, I should have known. Should have double checked everything. Yeah, it doesn't have earthquake. Um. Wait, I just realized that I was playing the same song the entire time, my bad. Um, Cause usually I have playlists on my computer that I wanna keep, like I wanna just let the playlist play in the background so you guys have like different music. But now it was like the same music the entire video, which was uh, not what I was going for. So since I doubled earlier, I'm just gonna knock off this time. He goes chomp there making a mid ground, is he Z move? Yeah, he's the move. That's rough for me, actually. <laughs> Dude, I want to go DNC here so badly. I know this is a bad play, but I just want to do it for the life. Dude, how did I know? Did he? Ah, how did I know? <laughs> I had to do it for the video. I, I don't really know if I would have made this in the tournament play. I just had to click it for the video. And I'm not real enough to click um, rocks right there. I could have. I could have clicked rocks, but I already made the wild play of going hard DNC, so... I didn't want to make another wild play and have him stay in on the earthquake reading me. I'm gonna go Zygarde here on the Volt Switch. Even if he Ice Beams, I should be able to eat it up. Bob! 
How does it feel, my guy? Ooh, this guy got put in a bag with God, and Megina goes down, which means my DNs, you know, puts in a lot of work when it comes in on guard chomp. But yeah, I mean, this guy kind of had a rough matchup. Um, I shouldn't be talking too early, though, because... Well, Clefable, I don't think it can beat me, because... I can just go to this big boy Kyurem. I didn't mean to actually go to it. <laughs> Hello? I was just saying I could go to this and then weaken him. And then we... Like, I just have to weaken him and then go for the Z after. Yeah, and now I just pop the Z and I get a kill. I mean, he pretty much has to pick his father. I mean, that worked. Though, Kyurem was really good for the... Um, Kyurem was really good for the Torn. Okay, now we get the type of team that I don't want to face. Nice caps, my guy. <laughs> nice caps, Mr. Good luck, have fun. Um, see, Sash Lander. Might be Sash Lander, yeah. Oh, his Halucha is Misty Seed thingy. The other seed, I don't know what the name is, but it's not Electric Seed. Um, Dude, this is annoying. I just confuse him to M1, I think. <laughs> Let me go for the luck. Great game plan, I know. Ah, we hit a hurricane. Good god. Do I need rocks gone? And well, obviously rocks are a bit annoying. Wait, how do I not lose to Halucha is my question. I have Glare Zygat, but like... <laughs> that's like not a great counter. He might just boom here. He can also spam rocks, he just booms. Okay, that kills me. Honestly, that might not have been the play. Yeah, but I feel like if I would have gone for Kane, I would have missed it anyway, so... <laughs> There's my reasoning why I made that play. Now... I could see him going Gyarados. I feel like... Kyurem gives me a good matchup versus almost everything. Well, Finny... Hmm. Like Kyurem, Kyurem's health is kind of important for checking the Gera. The Gera is mega on this team, right? And it's Z-move Zygarde or Z-move Megina. Mm. Uh, this might just be a misplay, but I feel like clicking this. He clicks Reflect, okay. It's cheese type of green thing. So how Lucha is gonna come in afterwards. Um, does Zygarde even live a plus to hit? Because if Zygarde dies to plus to Halucha, I can just forfeit right now. <laughs> Oh, plus two high jump kick is a roll to Oko, my, my specific set. It does 80. Yeah, it's in my favorite. And then I can get a glare off. Well, actually, Halucha might be forced to hard high jump kick my Kirim because ICMZ would bob him. Or Ice Beam. I don't know how much Ice Beam would do. But yeah, he probably just goes uh, Lucha because of the seed. I mean, if he doesn't go Lucha, then the seed runs out later. Here, um, and these people are taking their sweet ass time. I jump kick Okos. Um, wait, no, it's a plus two. It's a roll in his favor. Um, I think Kyurem is too valuable, honestly. Like, at this point, that he didn't Moonblast, he didn't Moonblast me with Finny. I can glare. I can glare Halucha, right? Because it's in the air. It's not affected by terrain, right? If I'm wrong here and I cannot glare him, then I'm screwed, and then I have to stay in and lose. Um, I think I go hard to this and click glare, but like, he really went for SD. I could have just killed him with Z move. <laughs> Drain punch is not gonna kill me. Glare does work as Misty terrain that, um, only affects grounded mons. Cool. Now. Yeah, I really don't have a counter for this. He's just gonna drain punch here. What do I say? Um, I need my Kyurem for the Gera is basically what I'm thinking. Cause, well, the Gera could be Mega, which means Tank can also check it. Jirachi is... Uh, Jirachi is kind of good. Uh, I think I just sank my... Oh, he gets paralyzed. Okay, now I'm gonna switch out. Wait, um, I think I should just sack that. Yeah. Well, I can still hope for the para here, obviously. 
But I like. Hmm. Wait, oh, I'm faster, right? He's parrot. For some reason, I thought I would be slower. Don't ask me why. I thought I looked just like super fast. So he should have high jump kick then. He should not have drain punch if high jump kick had a chance to kill me. I feel like I didn't think this through optimally. Uh, so here I can either HP fire or. I feel like I want to HP fire this. Shift gears. We go Tang here as he's gonna attack me. Ice beam? No comment. Oh, this is bad because I don't have earthquake. This is really bad. Oh no, I max for death. So I'm really confident I can live with plus one Z, exactly. Um No, I just go Jirachi. Uh actually that might have been a misplay. Do I, I don't outspeed him, yeah. This is five hundred stronger. Though Iron Hand might be the better play. In case I'm faster, because it has a flinch chance. I should have oh he's Messing up anyway. He thought I wasn't scarred. Cool. It really didn't matter what I clicked there. I don't know if it was better though, but he misplayed. Now, I feel like Kyurem plus Tangros helps me versus the Gera. Um. Yeah, I think I just go to this bad boy here. I click Fusion Bolt. Did he show Intimidate? I, I did not pay attention. He did show Intimidate, so he's definitely Mega. Um, he can live a Fusion Bolt, yes, but... It's gonna bring him range of E-Speed from my Zygarde. So now I can just sack my... I can... I don't know what I wanna sack, honestly. I feel like this Kyurem is just too good to sack it. Well, if he, what if he's Rest Gyarados? Let's say he's Rest Gyarados and I switch out here. I think I go into my tank growth. If he's rest, I might be screwed though. I figured he wasn't. And now, I think Bandit E-Speed kills. If it doesn't, I messed up. So it was actually the play to keep the Zygarde around, but I didn't think about it. Like, I had to keep it around because of the, what's it called? <laughs> Wait, if he Dragon Dances, I lose. I think I misplayed this. Um, I should have sacked something else. I needed tank potentially. Did I? How much does East speed do? Dude, now I'm taking my time and I'm getting super tired. It's like so late at night. Zygarde, um, let's just say he's offensive. Mm, I think I'll just E speed him for damage. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, that was that was a misplay. That was not the play. <laughs> How to choke with the darker? No. Damn, how to choke with the darker? I don't know why I even switched because, like, E speed Garen. I mean, he's gonna sub into berry range. I don't think I can win now. Well, I guess not. Yeah, that was like questionable. I don't know what the fuck I was doing with that endgame. Damn, that was a questionable as fuck endgame. My bad, guys. It's 2 11 a.m. in my defense. Okay. We get probably screens. I don't know if this is screens, though, because you usually don't see a rep. Well, I guess it's webs plus screens, potentially. Oh, man. I don't want to play this. I'm, I'm not even going to say have fun. Like, what the fuck is this Get me off? Uh, we can lead with the answer here. Oh, he let... Yeah. Well, he's just going to liquidation. Which gives me my Kyurem. I honestly should have led with Kyurem. Hmm. I don't think he's gonna rock on a potential Mega DNC. I could have Protect, which is rare, but it's used in Sun Moon. So Scizor is coming out, or I guess if he's, if he's Sash, he might just stay in, which is why I'm gonna attack. Um, Sash is a really bad item on a Raccoonit because it usually lives anyone hit, but yeah, it lives it anyway, so I don't know if it's Sash. Um, yeah, I mean, it might just go Scissor, nice, no, sexy, cool. I can def potentially definitely defog them. Dude, Scissor is such a threat to this team, good gravy. I think I just have to fire punch. Well, never mind. <laughs> he knocked their, um, 
Not sure what he predicted. Maybe the torn. Oh cool, I'm still faster because it's just slow scissor obviously. And now I don't want to go torn though. That's the problem I have here. I think I want to go tang and HP fire. If my Zygarde is still faster, then I want to go to my Zygarde here. Now with the web, my Zygarde should be slower. 289. Hmm. I mean, if I go Torn, I have to hit a Hurricane, which is the bad thing about this. Uh, how much does HP 5 on Tang do? Okay, now I'm taking the 3th time. 53 to 64. I think that might just be the play, because... I don't want to let him heal his scissor, for f like I just don't want to go torn and miss. Now what I can do here is sludge bomb, um, maybe get a poison as he reflects instead of light screen, break the meter earthquake, get a poison there. So he's gonna go for the thing, right, so basically afterwards he can go Halucha, right? And I think I go with Zygarde here because then I can glare. Oh, I can go Diancy here. It's a heat. Diancy here is heat. Ah, he goes hard lucha as we predict that. He does not have. He does not have a thing up. Um, let's say my Diancy, if I stay in regular form. Uh, I guess. Um, how much special attack do I have? Um, no, only four special attack and hasty. Okay. Also, I don't know if you guys can like hear my computer in the background, my laptop, because like my laptop is bad and makes noises. But in a few weeks, uh, hopefully you guys won't hear that anymore when I get my new computer. So Moonblast is a role that I don't want to risk, so I'm just going to Mega Evolve. Well, pretty sure he can't kill me, right? Yeah. mega -ing is definitely the play. If he can't kill me, cool. Mm, yeah, the extra health should not really come into play. Well, actually kind of comes into play because... Like, it kind of can come into play because the web doesn't affect me if I stay in regular form. But I can also default the web. And now I feel like... If I Moonblast... How much does that do to Manaphy? I think I just Moonblast. What do I need this for? I don't need this here. I just Moonblast. And then he is slower than me. He did not even go for Z move. And now I get him in range of E speed. Do I need my rocks? Do I want my rocks or do I? Now I definitely want him in range of E speed. The problem is his scissor gets to heal though. Does this have ice beam? Because if it doesn't have ice beam, I can go tank. Yeah, I think I go tang after. Scissor still gets to heal though because of the rain. What do I sack? I think I sack this. Click serve. And now... Uh, does Kyurem live a plus to hit? Yeah, there's gonna be a bit of a shorter life. I'm not, not too motivated at the moment. Nice late at night session. Uh, Manaphy. Got that coolant at a tail glow, not coolant. I assume does 74.9 max. And how much does Surf in the Rain do? Surf in the Rain might just do more. I know I've messed up that b those calcs before, like step versus non step move. Yeah, Surf in the Rain definitely does more. And it destroys me. I mean. I feel like mm -mm -mm. I think I just got this. This was like maybe a bit questionable because if I lose this, I got becomes a problem. Oh, also in the last game, I did not use my brain at all. He crits me, which is annoying. Oh, he's just gonna go for screens one more time, I guess. Hmm. I think what I might have to do here is go into my Zygarde, predicting him to go for light screen, and then glare the scissor because I don't have another. But yeah, actually, this just being in 
Because there's no reflect. This means Scissor can't heal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This means Scissor can't heal. Because he, yeah, well, he can knock off my band, but well, actually, yeah, uh, he might be able to knock off my band and then live a thousand arrows. Um, so no, I think I just spam thousand arrows because I'm banded, and this dude has no reflect up, and thousand arrows. Oh, that does nothing. Hello, what? Why did I do so little? Now he's gonna coil and he's bury. Mm. Should be able to live a plus to hit though, right? Yeah, exactly. So we chip him down. The thing is, um, if I, hmm, I might have to hit a hurricane versus the scissor. Well, I think I sank my Kyurem here. Damn, Kyurem lived the hit. If I knew that Kyurem lived it, I sh I would I should have caught that. My bad, dude. My bad, guys. Oh, what the fuck? Kyurem lived. Damn, this one is so fast. Oh, there's a there's a light screen. Yeah, this was a bit weird. This end game again. Nice dog messing up. Should be able to eat this hit though, yeah. And HP fire him so he can't roost. Which he's gonna try to roost here, I think. Uh, yeah. So this should do more than half at least. Bet. Ah, oh, damn. Yeah, I feel like <laughs> misplays were made for sure. Um. No, I just thousand arrows. And we kill him, yeah. Thank you guys for watching, but that was like odd. That was like bad on my end. Team is gonna be in the description. Um, yeah, just in general, if you guys want me to talk about anything that's not Pokemon related in these lives, I guess you can give me some suggest suggestions. But it's hard for me to talk about other stuff that's not Mons related because English is not my first language and I have like a lot of trouble. Like Blunder talks about music and stuff like that. I don't like. I don't listen to rap music. I, I, like I'm not into all the American stuff and that American rap and just in general. Like when Blunder starts talking, like it's fun for me to listen, but I cannot. I could not like talk myself that way, unfortunately. Um, also, you guys will see an option where you can get member, right? There is a um, button where you can subscribe to me and left to that, I think left to that, you will see an option where you can be member of my channel, which is for, um, I think $5 or 5 euros a month. So if you guys can support me and want to do that, um, I would appreciate it a lot. Basically what you can do is um, whenever I stream, which will be, um, when I get my new computer, I will stream a few times with my friends. Then you guys can like use special emotes in the chat. At the moment there's only one emote, which is like a rage emote that you can use. But once I get one member or two members, then I get extra emotes. And then you guys can also suggest emotes to me that you want me to put there that you can use in the chat. And um, yeah, I will make another video about this as well. I don't know why I said that at the ending. I should have said this at the beginning. And yeah, also when you guys put a comment in my video, I will immediately see that you are a member. And then when you suggest something to me, like you suggest a serious idea, um, like let, or you say, please use this mon in the next live, then you obviously, you get picked over the other guys. Um, if you are a member and yeah if you cannot afford to pay five dollars a month um but you still want to support me then you can do that by hitting the thumbs up button subscribing and sharing the video with your friends um which would really help me a lot because i'm trying to upload way more for you guys um i know i've been slacking a bit but don't worry um the uploads are going to be coming and yeah basically if you guys support me, I can just invest more time and I can I can give you guys daily um, content. If um, Yeah, I mean, obviously, if I make a little bit more money, because YouTube itself, like the video that you get from the ads, from people watching the video, that's like not, um, not enough. Like, <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much what I wanted to say. And um, I thank you so much for watching. And I will...
probably record a back-to-back -back shot on live just because well after I get something to eat because that's actually what I should be doing like I have these days I have days where I record four or five videos in a row but then I have days where I don't feel like recording at all and the problem that's what I did wrong in the past I used to just upload all the videos I had saved back up in one day and then I had uploaded like four five six videos one day but then the next two days I had nothing to upload because I didn't feel like recording at all those days but like what I should be doing instead is just upload one or two of those videos and keep the others for the next days until I feel like uploading again and then I can still have daily uploads and only record on the days I feel like I'm recording um yeah I don't know why I'm telling you guys all this maybe some of you are interested in it but yeah, like I said let me know what you want me to talk about in the video if, like if you want, want me to talk about something else that is not the game and yeah I mean I throw through some of those end games kind of but whatever nice click clickerage coming through and yeah, peace out. I'm so good at messing up my outros though, I feel. that I'm kind of annoyed at that.